this information is for those who are women and they are involved in the academic area that we call STEM. STEM, S-T-E-M. So if you are a woman, if you are a lady, and you are in the field of STEM, that is science, technology, engineering, and mathematics. So if you are a woman, or if you know anybody, a woman or a lady, or a current student, a graduate or something, but a woman, a lady, that is in STEM. I mean, this, not many people know of this in Sweden. So um, Sweden now has this opportunity for scholarship just for women. And um, it is not for everybody, for every country. It is for women that are from 10 different countries in between Africa and Asia. Do you see this now? So when this type of information come, I mean, these are opportunities that we should take advantage of. Now, when they streamline opportunities to a certain category of people, it also means that the competition will be less. You see that now? And um, it also means that um, you stand a chance because it's not for everybody. It's not for all countries. But they've defined the area they want to take people from, Africa and Asia. And they only limited it to just 10 countries. And luckily for you, there is Nigeria as part of these words, African countries. So um, it's just for women who are in STEM. So let me call the list of the countries for you. So if you find yourself as a citizen of this country between Africa and Asia, so let me call the African countries first. We have Kenya, we have Nigeria, we have Rwanda, we have South Africa. So four African countries, I guess, Kenya, Nigeria, Rwanda, and South Africa. Only four African countries. So then the rest countries are from Asia, Bangladesh, Indonesia, um, Malaysia, Philippines, um, Thailand, and Vietnam. So out of 10 countries, we have four African countries there. So if you are a woman and you are from Nigeria, Rwanda, South Africa, um, Kenya, this is your opportunity to apply for this scholarship. You stand the chance. So what's the benefits of this scholarship? There's going to be a full tuition coverage for your two years that you'll be studying your master's program. Full tuition. Again, um, you will get a monthly stipend of 12,000 Swedish krona every month. 12,000 Swedish krona is about 1,200 or 300 dollars every month. You see that now? And um, when you get this scholarship, you are going to get a travel allowance. You know, they are going to pay for your travel from your country, from Kenya to Sweden, from Nigeria to Sweden. They will pay for your travel. And um, you are going to get the chance to join a global network of professionals in Sweden. So if you're a woman in STEM, this is your opportunity. Share this video, share this video, share this video to anyone who needs it. If you have questions around this, I'll be happy to respond to your question. Let's go and have this done now. I'll see you in the next one.